COVID-19 is affecting the spirit of a lot of people here in Kelloland. Many businesses are shutting down, including Dakota Spirit in Sioux Falls. Kelloland's Matt Holson shows you how they're cheering their way through this rough time. Dakota Spirit's building may be closed, but its staff and cheerleaders are staying connected thanks to social media and more. It's really, really sad for us as, you know, coaches and as owners because we don't get to do what we love every day, which is seeing the kids come through those doors. Lincoln senior and Apollo team member Lauren Jatan says when the season ended so fast, it was stunning. Two competitions have been canceled and Dakota Spirit won't be going to Summit in June, even though five of its teams qualified. It's just too much of a financial commitment during uncertain times. It was pretty devastating to hear the news that like I'll never be competing again. I couldn't take in all the glory in that last competition, but got to keep moving forward. Instead, teams are chatting online and Dakota Spirit is putting together daily workout and kindness challenges. I organized my parents' pantry for them. It was much needed. Families are also creating cheer routines from their own homes. Some of the most hilarious, fun videos. So all there's, although there's a lot of challenge in this, a lot of challenge brings opportunity. Fritch says coming together to pull through this is right in line with the team's motto. Here at Dakota Spirit, it's called We Over Me. And right now we're really just holding on to that now more than ever. You know, these kids are individually so disappointed. Um, but we're asking them, you know, put the community, put our nation's health in front of your own own desires to go to cheerleading practice. Jatan gets it, even though it's not the ending she envisioned. I'd say you can't really change the fact that it's happening, so you just kind of have to roll with it and just do what you can with what you have. In Sioux Falls, Matt Holson, Kelloland News.